of professors of phonics. We are going to make a silly poem using the at sound. So we're going to just be changing the beginnings of the words that end in at. And as you know, at is a high frequency word, but when you change the beginning of it, you put something at the beginning, it becomes whole new words. So we're going to play with that. Obviously at has the short vowel A in it, and it ends with the T, the T sound, at. So, let's make a silly poem together. Okay, I wanna use these words here. So, I am going to say, the cat, so I have the cat spilled milk on the mat. So the cat spilled milk on the mat. Splat! Spool at. So you might think, Miss Clark, how did you know how to, sp how to spell splat? Why well, I hear it, I'm like, spool. O S sp sp S P spool O L spool at splat. And since we're second graders, we're quicker at blending, right? So spool at splat. So splat. The cat spilled milk on the mat. Splat. Then the cat said, Sorry about that. The TH, that's called a digraph. A digraph is not a blend. This is a blend. A blend is when you can hear the sounds in it. So spool, sp, ul, you can hear the sounds, that's a blend. But when two letters come together and they make a whole new sound, like as in that, the TH, you don't hear t, at, right? You hear that. So the T and the H traveling together, that makes a digraph. And a digraph makes a whole new sound. Just like in chat, that is a digraph. These two are digraphs. And this is a blend. So, going back to our poem, the cat says, Sorry about that. So I'm going to write that down. Sorry about that. And I got to put my quotation marks because he said something. Sorry about that. So here's our poem so far. The cat spilled milk on the mat. Splat! Sorry about that. Then... The two cats had, oops, I put hat. I put H-A-T, hat. Let me change it. Had a chat. So we have another digraph, the C-H digraph in chat. The cat spilled milk on the mat. Splat! Sorry about that. Then the two cats had a chat. Yes, it's a very silly poem. Feel free to pause this video and copy it down just to practice your spelling and your rhyming words. All right, till next time. Bye, my professors of phonics.